Oh. It is the best sound I have ever had in my life. It is the sound of love. It is the sound of passion. It is the UEFA Champions League night. And once it's 8 p.m. right now, KZK would be sitting right here in the studio saying dot games. And if you speak Igbo very well, you would understand the word that says Nabania. <laughs> you might not understand where I'm coming from right now. <laughs> it's a big night. It is a big night. It is a big night. So big, 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 big night, right? I'm loving the sound. I had to take my time to let the sound go a long time, go a long way. Play, play more. Play more, play more, play more. Just keep playing, right? <laughs> I have to say, miracle doesn't happen in church alone. It does happen on football. When we opened the last yesterday, Stanley Samson, Chibike Medics, Lolo himself, Emmanuel, Sani, Babatunde, Babatunde again, Anthony, Chinedu. All of those guys predicted, and none of them got it right. It's just magical to talk about football. It's a beautiful game, right? I'm just still thinking, just all in my head, I'm trying to reminisce if I should let every other uh, talk stay on the side and talk more about the Champions League. I'm still thinking. Let me just keep thinking, right? But I'll let you know, Kylian Mbappe struck twice as Paris and German battled back to beat 10-man Barcelona 4-1 to book a place in the Champions League semi-final with a 6-4 aggregate triumph on Tuesday. Rafinha fired Barcelona ahead early on, but Ronald Rojo, 29 minute red card, turned the tide in Paris Saint German favor. The Spanish champions leading by two goals, pulling a 3 2 quarterfinal first leg win. Osman Dembele and Virginia leveled the tie for Paris Saint German, and the deadly Kylian Mbappe hit a brace to put them into the final four for the first time since 2021. The French champions have never won the trophy despite a huge investment but demonstrated that they have the attack and the weapons to their squad to do so. <laughs> Paris Saint German coach Luis Enrique, who led Barcelona to the 2015 Champions League, said he believed his team would turn things around despite having managed to after a first leg come to defeat and he proved it. Five times winners Barcelona. We are dreaming of a fourth semi final return since 2019. But Roda, that Rojo, red card, oh goodness me. For pulling down relentless Bradley Bakula. On the mind, their grip on the tie. It became another in a series of European nightmares for the Catalans, the Coolers. The Barcelona side, who last won the trophy back in 2015. Guess what? Enrique Brax, without a Rojo's red card, we will still have beaten Barcelona. <laughs> Paris and German coach Luis Enrique has boasted that without Ronald Rojo saying it up, he said would have still beaten Barcelona. The French giant dumped Barcelona 4 1 in the quarterfinal, second leg to go through 6 4 on aggregate. Let's go to Signal Iduna Park. The side has got Homels, Sean Beck, Michael Royce, Matt Sain, Sebastian Hala, Jadon Sancho. Great team. Tezic Eden is the manager. Dortmund down Atletico Madrid in a thriller to make our Champions League semi final. I'm liking the sound. Keep enjoying it, right? <laughs> Borussia Dortmund stamped into the Champions League semi-final with a rip rowing 4-2 home win over Atletico de Madrid on Tuesday that saw them fight back um, from a 2-1 better word 
to feed in the first leg to win the top half for an aggregated German side Scott Wise in the first half and looked to be cruising into the last four but Atletico de Madrid bounced back with two goals early in the second half to put Dortmund on the ropes before they dug deep to complete a superb comeback. The German side soared the Scott Wise in the first half and looked to be cruising. Can I let you know the German side will now take place? Take on Paris Saint Germain, who came from a 4 2 down to beat Barcelona Football Club in the semis with a place in the final on June 1 at London Wembley Stadium at stake. And that game got off to a flying start on midfielder Marcel Sabitza. And I wonder why Manchester United let that guy go. <laughs> okay. Marcel Sabisa was only prevented from putting home side, putting the home side ahead of the third minute by a large ditch block from Caesar Aspliqueta. As the home side came flying out of the blocks, Julian Bratt put Dortmund level on aggregate in a 64 minute, latching onto the brilliant power from Matt Hommels and firing home and far Venice lead to Dortmund took the lead in the quarterfinal tie as Iron Madsen caught in from the left and drilled the perfectly split shot at the game and that was right in at the foot of the far post his name is iron mats in chelsea Looney. and you can say the past was history let's talk about today the big match feature i got my man dozy nukumazi and i spoke the evil language for those who understand I would love to rephrase again. Take me back to the A side, though. One nephew for Naban here. Type any nigga, man. Okay, so I'm gonna do a translation to that so you don't get lost if you don't understand what I'm saying, though. And I said this night, and I said tonight, so many things, everything would happen tonight. I'll see it again before I leave the show. I like to speak that evil. I keep it in my memories. I don't want to forget that, right? But tonight, Manchester City and Real Madrid produced a classic first leg in the UEFA Champions League quarterfinal as they meet for the return in Northwest England level at 3 3. The size of meeting for the third season in succession in the latter stages of the UEFA Champions League. They have 50 knockout tie in nine season with City having struck first at the Santiago Bernabeu on 9 April through Bernardo Silva second minute. Free kick. Ten minutes later, however, Ruben Diaz deflected in an Eduardo Camavinga shot, and two minutes after that, Madrid were in front through Rodrigo goes. In a post-stating contest, spectacular time, spectacular long-range effort from Phil Ford in 66, and with his first city goal, Josco Vario. 7-1 seems to have extended the visa run of successive Champions League victory to 11 and 11 minutes. From time, Federico Valverde volleyed in to leave the tie in the balance ahead of the city of Manchester decided tonight. Madrid all stayed sitting in a dramatic fashion in the semi-finals on their way to their 14th European Cup back in 2021-22 season. But Pep Guardiola's side took the revenge. At the same stage last season, a 4 0 second leg win in Manchester, Madrid. Record Champions League defeat and the place in the second second final, where City overcame Inter Milan to claim the trophy for the first time. The Spanish side have won 16 of their last, uh, you could say 16 of the 19 Champions League quarterfinal, including the last 11. But face opponents who have been victorious, India. Last three contests at the stage. What would happen tonight? But let's talk about the game played yesterday. Dozy, good evening. You're welcome to the show. Good evening. Uh, thank you for having me. And of course, uh, good evening to everyone listening or watching us uh, from wherever mm. you, know, you are. Right. You know, I feel like ringing the bell. Okay. You know, I don't know. Why, I don't. Why you want to ring the bell? I feel like it? ringing the bell for some <laughs> people. You know, there are some things that actually right. deserve the, the bell. PSG, Dortmund, you know, kicking off the two of the two spanish teams just right. in one night is mm. not a it wasn't an easy one but i give it to them very yeah. very nice okay so assist. let's start with signal iduna park yesterday mm. i personally do say i don't know a diego simeone to be a man who um would merge a scoreline and later get to you know 
um i don't know i know him as a defensive manager Very what changed well. what changed yesterday yeah. was it about the yellows was it about the dortmund was it about the home fans was it about the play how did a borussia dortmund after it was an equalizer they still mm. went back sabita i am Martin. how did it happen yeah it, that that game actually is something i give i give kudos to dortmund just like you said right. uh, simeone is someone that we know that he even got two goals today yesterday and even the last one mm -hmm. they played he saw we know that they will just call you one goal and then they will defend and frustrate you with right, defense so right. they are good at doing it packing the balls in order to you know maintain their win but uh, uh, dortmund is a team that uh, uh, i don't know if this season especially mm. they, they are attackers they have you know is one thing to 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 know how to play right. a, a, a team and another thing to know how to unlock defense you know mm. unlocking defense is not for every team yeah uh, so some teams they know how they can penetrate you gradually they just pull you out no matter how you try to block the right, they right. Will know how so that was what uh, these guys did yesterday mm. they tried to you know it's not that they, they were not even much defensive anyway they are let school guys they were not really much defensive and that early two goals they got uh, not quite too early anyway but that was in the first half right. they got those two goals and the, the the whole team changed the game because that uh, first half they were actually trying to mm. you know protect what they had right. but the two goals came so they had to come out in order to you know lead maintain their lead and then unfortunately these people uh, uh, couldn't uh, hold them they got two goals and had a draw i was expecting them from that see something means they got that equalized because that right. equalizer mm. still put them uh, on the lead by aggregate right you know i was expecting them to play that defensive game and maintain it at least it was better that uh, to right. something minutes mm -hmm. left to go I was surprised they couldn't do it but the, the that's why in fact the truth is that the dortmund guys they played very well right uh, master sabisa uh, 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 like of course sabisa. i was, I was uh, he, he, even that's when he left when like he left united right? after his loan spell mm -hmm. was uh, you know expired i was even i was among the people that actually rooted for him to be right, uh, right. retained by the club unfortunately mm -hmm. he was allowed to leave and if you watch his games in in, in the club though the club generally their performance right I don't know how to put Dortmund. Though they they play good football if mm -hmm. you watch them, but at the end of the day, you see them in the Bundesliga. They they don't get that top top position. Right, they they right. keep fighting, but will never get to that top. I don't know what's wrong with them. But for yesterday game, honestly, I give kudos to Dortmund. Okay, they so let really me congratulate really them. Uh, they did so well yesterday. Jadon mm. Sancho, you know, I, I saw him play. Can I, I, can I, even at day, right. during, during the first half, he played right. so well. It was uh, uh, the, back, the Marco Roy, all of them. Great team so, and uh, you know, but the likes of him also Atletico Madrid team, Morata. Uh, you know, none of those guys could stop uh, Korea and help Korea. You know, we could call the names of those guys, so wouldn't the guys? None of them were able to stop uh, the signal to the park people. The fans really came out in mass and ate a very big game uh, for them. Congratulations to them again, I say. But let's go uh, quickly, Dozy, to talk about the big one that happened yesterday. Mm. You said it and it happened the way you wanted. Um, uh, I don't know. Enrique has come to say that we would have gotten the result right even even though Arojo remains in the game. And that, for me, I would say is a no. I, I, I can say that. I, I, I won't really agree totally with him because right. they played really well. In fact, yeah, they yeah. were in the game more than Barcelona. Right. They played fantastic. And, yeah, yeah. and PSG, they really have that away, mm -hmm. especially in the Champions League. They know how to get results away from home. Right. So, yesterday, they played well, yes. But saying that you would have gotten the win, even I, I wouldn't totally agree with him. Though I can't say mm. because it didn't happen. You know he right. was taken off and they took advantage of it i wouldn't say that maybe if he was there they would if he was there he, he playing against a 10 man uh, 11 against them we all know how it can be in right, a football yeah. team and that's one of their major defenders so taking him out of the game at that early stage come mm. on it's it's played in fact it's made a very huge contribution right. you know to the psg win so you can't just say uh, because he was if he was there you were still, no 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 mm. i wouldn't totally agree okay so him. my point on that game yesterday right does the m i would say it again and i can say anywhere uh, Enrique is a good manager. We know how good he is. And uh, Enrique has this part of the game where he, he, he knows how to study the game. Mm. Now, the game played yesterday was about mind of big names. Um, David E was saying Enrique showed Javi that I'm still your manager. And I said to him, That was, that was actually what I, 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 would I, not, I, I thought that you know, yesterday. Right. Because, no, the truth is that, yes, uh, uh, what's their name? Mm. Barcelona, they were one man down. Right. But the truth is that if you look at the game, compared to the previous yeah. game, they played very, will, very nice football Dozy, yesterday I will, I will, against Barcelona let compared me to the first game. Yeah, leg. I so, know. Dozy, let's be realistic. Okay, let me talk about Enrique first of all. Let me mm. go to Barcelona. Uh, yesterday, they started in a room and a goal post. There was a change in that team. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. The first leg, we had Dembele playing alongside uh, Kylian Mbappe from the left side. Mm. Now, this time around, what they did, 
uh, uh, Enrique, good manager, that's what he had to do. He bring, he he, he told Mbappe, play like a free roll, play everywhere, just go mm. around, enjoy yourself. Now he brought in a Bradley Bacola. That man was a ton of the flesh on Yusconde. Yusconde was resting the other time. Now, even in that game, you would notice that Mbappe from the start was struggling a little bit because Arojo was going with him everywhere. Everywhere. He was, was, he, he was assigned to, yeah, to Mackie. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Now, the back line, they had, they had uh, Makimi and also Lucas Hernandez. Now, the change in that team, Nuno Mendes played his normal role this time around attacking. Now, Hashraf Hakimi was not in the first leg. He mm -hmm. returned back. Now, Vitinia playing in the down middle of the park where we had Zari Emery. Zari Emery did not get the start of the first game and also paired with, uh, what's his name? Uh, Reese. Is his name? Uh, Fabi, no, Fabi, no, Re Re Reese came Fabi, in. Re Reese came in. No, Fabian Reese started the game. Mm. He started, he started, even the last one, he started. Now, Emery was the man that did not start. So, it's about manager going back. So, those, why I want to say no to what Enrique said, I will tell you is this. The truth of the matter remains. If these guys were complete, because I feel like Barcelona needs to have a turnaround. This is not the Barcelona we used to know on the right card, on the Pep Guardiola. Even yeah. with the red card, they still play you. It's not showing. Now, if you want to play against a team that's advancing high, like that of a, of a Paris Saint-Germain, you need to have ball holders. The moment Arojo got off the game, Barcelona got in shambles. Now, they took off the man that was the man of the match for me, even for the 20 minutes, Lamio Yamal. You saw that. No, the moment no, Lamio no. Yamal got that off point, the game. At that point, so, sorry so, to at that point right. I wouldn't blame Xavi for taking No, no, no. no I know it's normal. Uh -huh. But those in my point remains that I would say, the reason why we saw Paris and German establishing so well, Bacola was doing his thing, but then Lamio Yamal was on Nuno Mendes. He was unstoppable. Mm. He brought in the first goal from Rafinha. Mm. So Barcelona looked complete. But the moment, I mean, there was no ball holder. Nobody could hold on the game. They were, before, I mean, they got on our The truth is that uh, Javi, Javi actually, I will fought him somehow. In as right. much as PSG, they came, they came in full force right. and again they, they were one mm -hmm. man down. But you know, funny enough, Barcelona got the first goal yesterday. Yeah. You know, they got the first goal, extending their lead by two goals. Right. So I would have, and when they, when uh, Javi saw that, okay, we are one man down mm. at that point. I feel. He would have done everything possible. He, to, of course, he tried. He, try, he tried. He to tried. Do yes, he, he tried. But Martinez, right? he tried. But uh, uh, I, would, I, would, I, would, I thought he would have done more when mm. I mean defensively okay. to protect what he had. Because at that point, no matter what, no matter how good you are as a team, mm. even 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 uh, Man City. I know Man City most times when they when they you see them one man down and they still go ahead to win a game. Mm. But you see this type of Champions League right. game. If if they go one man down and they fail and they and they and they don't you know get their their, 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 their things right mm. they are going to lose against any team at this level or at this stage right, of this tournament right. now so if you you know you are already one man that and you have an advantage already mm. you have to do whatever thing but it i wonder takes i wonder what i wonder what he would because, have done it was a if, 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 if you make any mistake try minutes. try to leave that defense those teams they are no, going no, to no. Those one man down is is, is, is a big is a big yeah, is a big thing in football because those the truth is that he he tried what he could do he was also conscious of wanting to win he wants to score you know when you score a goal you get ahead i know you, you get but, high, but you still have to you have, have to you have to you have to you have to work in between, Martinez. between defending the one you have and scoring extra goal at that point one man that is a is a stress the, the remaining 10 they'll be they'll be stressed out there will be one or two players that will fit that okay. will feel the impact okay. of that okay. absence so more it, than the other person tell me tell me the truth did you see a killian about in 30 minutes in that game Let's be realistic. No, yeah, uh, personally, I actually saw him in that game from the second half. That okay. was personally, okay. I would say from yes, he, right. he actually made I love one Mbappe. Or two attempts, I love Mbappe. Second so much, half was where I love to in say. Through. I would love to say that the Paris Saint Germain. I love the players. A good manager. We saw the best of them after that red card, but then they got the results. Let them go and face Dortmund. I wish them all of the best. Save. <laughs> and also, let's talk about this one now. Uh, Paris Saint Germain. Arojo uh, was given the straight red card for far on Bradley Cola outside the box, and he will miss. Uh, he will miss. The next one, not this time around, they're out. Uh, currently, four crooks have beat South Carl, two goals in three minutes for Dortmund to pull them 5 4 on aggregate against Atletico de Madrid. Sabitza, my man of the match in that came on Madsen. Kylian Mbappe, great player, potential Ballon d'Or winner for the one goals in 42 games this season. Isn't that amazing to talk about? We'll talk about us now, don't worry. Barcelona eliminated from the UEFA Champions League. Barcelona out, the dream's over. Osman Dembele responded well after being bored in Barcelona. He went home with that award, the man, a, of, the match. Man, man of the match. With the match award. Man of the match award. It was amazing to watch uh, uh, Osman Dembele ride. But us now, let me let you know, Arsenal fans out there, something good can happen if you win the Champions League. I don't know if Dozi can analyze that though. Arsenal can qualify for the FIFA World Cup, FIFA Cup 
FIFA Cup World. That's what they call it. Uh, some call it the FIFA Cup World 2025 only if they win the UEFA Champions League. Now, Lisa Rico with Paris Saint Germain this season. Let's talk about how good this man has, has been. The four line BP will get on the phone line, don't worry. Fourth in the league on 10 points clear. Semi final, the UCL against Dortmund. Coupe de France final against Leon. Plus, don't forget, they won the French Super Cup in January against Toulouse. Now, UEFA top scorers, Kylian Mbappe, eight goals. Harry Kane, seven goals. Anton Griezmann, six goals. I'm sorry, you can't make it. Haaland, can you make it more? Six goals you've got. Now, talking about the top assistors in the UEFA Champions League. Marcel Sabitza, five assists. Elkai got the one, four assists. He can't make it again. Sakai has got four assists. He can't do it tonight. Jude Bellingham has a lot of advantage to do it again. Four assists. Vinicius Junior for assist. According to Thomas Toko, Manuel Niwa and Leroy Sane could play today against Arsenal. Due to the situation with Nabri and Kingsley Coleman, Leroy Sane will probably have to grade his state for as long as possible. Kylian Mbappe is the first player in top flat European football to score 40 goals across all competition this season. Josie, let me let you know Barcelona paid nearly 300 million pounds. No, 300 million euro for Coutinho and Osman Dembele. One of them scored two goals to knock them out and order. Scored, for, scored two goals again during an A2 hammering. <laughs> okay, so um, I have other ones to give out, but not on Champions League. I'll talk about it with the sound. Let's go with this big game coming up again. Having so far the back to... Back-to-back 5-1 -back humiliation at the Allianz Arena, Arsenal will be aiming to put previous struggles behind them when they visit Bayern Munich tonight for the second leg of their finally poised UEFA Champions League quarter-final meeting on Wednesday today. Arsenal so far the four goal with defeat away at the German side in 2015-2017 as well as the 5-1 trashing at home seven years ago. And a 2-2 draw at the Emirates Stadium last week did lead to, to a turn for those troubles. Kyle Saka upon the scoring ball, Leandro Trossard. 76 minutes strike was required to salvage a draw after Serge Nabri level and Harry Kane penalty had Thomas Tuchel side in the ascendancy. Controversy arose with plentiful in the first half meeting too. Astro plays left Thomas Tuchel license when Gabriel Macahels picked up on David Ryan Pass from a goal kick inside the Arsenal area. With the two Brazilian, or with the Brazilian better was seemingly no relation play had started. The host also wanted a penalty when Saka went down over Manu Nua leg late. But no spot kick was awarded in the second half of a gripping opening leg. And that leaves it to a play in unique tonight. Dozy, are you scared of tonight? <laughs> How do you think Arsenal uh, fans are feeling? Well, it's football, it's football. I, the yesterday game, the teams that, that were knocked out were the ones leading. Mm. Leading in the first, after right. the first day, yeah. uh, they had one goal advantage. That's the magic of the game. Going into the second one, and right. both of them were knocked out. Mm -hmm. Then the people to play today, all draws. You right. Know, two, two draw, three, three draws. So mm -hmm. let's see how the both of them are going to look okay. like. Okay, let's, let's, let's quickly talk about the, the Champions League game, the big one, Real okay. Madrid tonight. What can Madrid do to, get, to try off over Man City? Looking at City's record. They, they let them just come out. Let them come out against Man City to beat these guys. I said this the last time before. before Are you the, rooting the for City? Game. Well, I, I don't. I don't know. Last time I said that I was rooting for PSG. I saw what God did to you know. Mm, don't say what but you unfortunately, feel. you know, we saw how the, the result turned out. But you see, against the uh, uh, Manchester City, right. Real Madrid against Manchester City. Trust mm. me, it's not going to be an easy one for for Real Madrid. But they need to do it. Personally, I root for them to. You know, yeah. to get a winner against Man City, but trust me, getting it is not going to be easy. Man City, they are tough. Mm. You know, they did they did something great against. In fact, they shocked Real Madrid that, right. uh, last game because Madrid never even expected. They got the first win against them. Madrid got a win, got a, 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 got a draw, and got a win. They still came back again mm. and still went ahead of them. It was just like it's. It, in fact, the game showed where two strong men are fighting. Right. You know, so. I also gave, gave, I gave them kudos for the first game. Those boys wasn't really easy. They, they did so well against Man City. But today, 
men is not really good. I don't know how what else to say. Oh, okay. Him, but <laughs> if Ancelotti right. should, you know, if he if he took his time to look at that first game, mm. he would. I, I believe by now he knows one or two things to pick out from the first one. Where to, you know, make some uh, changes if necessary. Where to give special instructions specific yeah. instructions to players look at this person especially that guy at the at, at that at that heart of the uh, midfield that's Rodri. right whatever thing it would take it's not easy to mark the guy Ever, you right. can't mark him it's very very difficult to mark right. him he, he, he just got this uh, dm attribute even right. his body he comes his body the weight well. and high. he knows yeah, how to, he's, so he's always well. difficult to mark him or Definitely, hold him down so true. but if uh, and Real Madrid doesn't even have that player that can match him body to body. He's only someone like Jude Bellingham. But Jude Bellingham, uh, uh, I don't know, he has that uh, 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 strength. He's right. a strong player uh, that can actually hold him. But Jude Bellingham is not the uh, uh, kind of player you will assign to hold somebody down. Mm. He, he's always a, a forward-minded. He wants to go, go get get to the goal. So, yeah. And besides, uh, Rodri is even the one that will try to hold him because he moves forward. So we need someone that actually plays central midfield or okay. plays, you know plays at the okay. back so let's see how it goes uh, for us now what you may quickly i'm going to talk about both games mm. in two minutes tell me for us now what you think tonight kizike mm. <laughs> do you want me to talk about i, I wanted game? to talk about it right <laughs> well yeah. i saw that actually support us now to win mm. i wish this game can everything can just happen in such a way <laughs> we already have one team from yeah. france one team from germany mm. you know if we can have one from england being uh, arsenal and then mm. one from spain okay so let's I just split it so, so i want to share uh, well, yeah that's what i want to share but for the game like you asked uh us now they are not they are especially what happened to the to them right. in, the pre, in the last game they played in the premier league they lost uh, mm. uh, to aston villa is coming back to play uh, for that champions league i think it, it, Mikel ateta should know now that just like we said last time he should have played that premier league focused on it and left right. champions but now know. that he has kind of yes Premier League has not ended yet right, right. but is 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 almost something that people are afraid of that they might end up losing out of it so mm. he should now focus on the champions league that he actually wanted to focus on whatever thing it would take to get that result against the uh, 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 bayern munich in germany in their home soil so it's not really going to be okay uh so someone has to be checked about javi hernandez said i told him it's a disaster javi reveals why barcelona lost to paris Saint german uh we there's no time to talk about javi hernandez i could say that again javi need to understand the champions league is not the la liga ea sports left for me he should control javi his talks temper. a lot he though he's temper. just a growing Trust manager he needs to up his game on that part his management uh he's um a was better word he, he doesn't have the good temper for me to say though uh, a good manager no no doubt right but on that part he need to work on himself he talks a lot though javi um it's understood that you have to open uh you have to call in because the last were open but quickly let me talk about the game coming up tonight uh let me start with the alliance arena looking at the record and how far it's been over time thomas Tuchel has got a lot of stock in sick today i mean everything for like i, I think that thomas Tuchel style seems to be under pressure because thomas Tuchel knows that today um it's a very big day this will be the last champions league he'll be managing the mutual concept by uh end of the city he'll be leaving bars and uh, bayern munich a bigger partner so he knows they need to get it right but don't forget the bayern munich are one side you don't underrate they are called with the traditional german team they play that fast they don't want to hold they don't that's why they don't sign player like the likes of a register of rigo Jorginho, sergio Puske. they don't need a register they need player like maso sabita the league player like marco royce who can be fast dictate the game hit play shoot and they love to play from the wing that's what dortmund is doing well gatins jeno sancho uh karima deyemi all from the wing they're very dangerous so they are a, a very 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 de deadly side now you hear me say kinsley coman is out sage number is out it's a big blow for them because they would have loved to play from the side but then Larry Sander returns man in you in the goal post Leon Goretz kind of middle of the pack looks very big and you know Kimmich just my play from the midfield maybe I don't know let's see how it pans out but Arsenal the only way I think Arsenal can get the result right tonight is to play with a high mentality don't ever get uh, to lose focus just keep playing the game because the moment you're beginning to understand that you're in germany and this alliance arena the fans and the rest of that will take you off so ateta has got a job to do tonight he needs to up his game he needs to let these guys know because Arsenal have this thing they do they, they have a good team but at some point they lose focus you know even when they were losing to one in, in at the emirates they were still playing they have a very relaxed team a well-deserved team they can get the result out tonight but time will tell but quickly 540 last of the open uh, another one again about the Real Madrid game tonight. I would say this again. Real Madrid is the only club in the world today that can play Manchester City without any pressure. 
even when you're winning them they are just playing like the old nigerian super eagle just they play <laughs> they have a very very great team i will remind you that your many would not be involved today that's a bad news but then that man rudiger Ada Militao would definitely want to get a start tonight. And then you and, look the other should, way. You should be very careful in that game. Who should be careful? Ada Militao. Militao, why? You should be very careful in that game. Why you say that? You know, he, he, there is, he has, there is a way he plays. And when, when the game is tensed up, mm. he, he, he tends to, 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 for, to ease it off on players. Right. So that he doesn't put them in a, in a danger position. I, yeah. I've watched several of his games, especially mm. in the Champions League. Mm. And he has that, once that game tensed up, you see him making getting on players and before you know it you get boots okay so or let me let, let, let so me even say this to, to you now like on the outside you need to know real madrid can win tonight and let me tell you real madrid can win tonight or how do they win i'm not the manager i'm not carlo but i just know that carlo has got a great team the likes of tony crows are uh, camavinga too many would be a blow but camavinga i mean good team because they have all surplus requirement now they've got federico valvade now last time they played what federico valvade was doing on rodri was giving rodri that run rodri was not able to hold the game so much to dictate so he was playing and bernardo was coming close to get the ball so of uh, uh, federico who is very very technical like that of vitinia yesterday you don't give such players those plays uh, also would have a job to do but should barely am I think he's just going to enjoy himself. He knows them very well. Uh, his former Sarawad was growing up, and I'm so sure he's got a lot to prove. Then Vinicius Junior, I talked about Mbappe yesterday. What shoe would he wear? And he felt like he, he came with a big shoe. If Vinny <laughs> would come with his big shoe today and as a car walker, it would be a very big fight. But let's talk about the City side because tonight uh, it would be a City game in the sense that, wow, Pep Guardiola will always find a way to dominate. They will just try. They will just have to find a way. Anyway, there's a KDB who happened to... Uh, he said it was, he ate, it was a poison. Like what he ate was poison. You know what I mean? Football poison. All right? The food wasn't cool for his body. It's actually a poison. Now, that's why we didn't see him start. But today, it's possible that every tendency that KDB will get a start. And anytime he starts, Haaland, I want to see Haaland uh, play big games and get a score goal. How can Haaland play tonight? He needs to up his game. That's a dangerous man called Phil Foden. You need to know that, boy. He's not smiling. If you give him all of the space, he will definitely destroy you. What about... You want to talk about this, man. I'm scared of this guy. This, this uh, Doku. Jeremy Doku. I, if a dog could get a start, I wouldn't be surprised. Because he's a great player. He run he, he can literally run down the, the, last, the, in the, the last few couple of games, I think he, he performed so well in, right. in, in that city. So I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, you know Pep with a tanks. He might might start to play Bernardo you, from the right. You can't even expect you can't even so uh, I, I, I predict not talk what about Pep Guardiola right. will do against against any team in any particular right. game. So he will, he might But it's a big game, zero seven hundred nine zero three now zero three now zero three. I made sure I talked to five forty. <laughs> I call the numbers again, 0700-903-903-903, the phone line, I'm a BP. let's go with the WhatsApp portal again, so you need to know, the WhatsApp number, 0817175-6338, 0817175-6338, it is on you, I don't have a winner, I did not have a winner yesterday, and it's so bad that this week, no winner from anywhere, we're not doing our shoe, 0700, do you want to chit chat with me, let's go. 903 903 903 Good evening, welcome to the show. What's your name? Hello, is anybody at home? Hello. Great to have you. Good evening, what's your name? Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> how are you doing today? Zubites, how are you doing? Uh -huh. I want I want predict. Okay, predict right, please. I I'm looking so, for a winner. Uh, Madrid. I give it to Madrid two one. You give two it to, to Madrid. Madrid. Okay, two goals to one. All right. Two goals to one for Madrid. Okay, okay, all right. I'll take that Zubi test. Thank you so much. All right, safe. Prediction would not be wrong. Okay, let's see how it pans out. Yesterday, most people said Paris and German will go through. And of course, you did get it right, but the scoreline was not my friend. Hello, good evening, welcome to the show. Is that about the home? The, the door is open. Welcome, good evening. What's your name? Hello, give you carry on All right, good evening. Let's have you. Welcome. I'm fine. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm okay. I'm very well. Thank you so much for your concern. What's your name? Yeah. Uh, my name is Godwin. I'm calling from Ikeja. Okay, Godwin. Let's talk. Welcome. Uh, you see you now. Yeah. Right. Uh, you right. I want to ask you. Have you asked yourself why did that year I like go? He's always in charge of possession. I didn't get you right. Possession. Sorry, I didn't get you right. What do you say? 
I said, have you asked yourself any every year Guardiola go or he's always in charge of both position? Mm. Right, I know, definitely. Mm -hmm. Can I tell you something, Godwin? You get it. You yeah, know what I said. yeah. I heard you. I heard you right. And let me, let me, let me say, let me reply to that thing you just said. The reason is because okay. Guardiola always struggle when he sees a team that looks like him. Gajola's, uh whatever he will hate is the fact that he don't want you to hold with the ball. He don't like you to play. So if you see the team that plays like him, he always get upset and he try to change it. So he loves to dominate and the reason is because they like to hold the ball. They are a playing side. Wow. Wow. So okay. you... What? Uh, no problem. Uh, let, let, let me predict. Okay. Godwin. The, last, go. the last time I predicted, I predicted a bad of a person. I said that was the work of a man. I predicted 2-0. <laughs> they won 5-0. <laughs> yeah, you did. I recall. Uh, Let's now, go. Uh, I'm predicting... I see how to play that game, but I'm predicting Madrid. Okay. Madrid. Madrid, 3-1. People yes. are going the other way, Madrid. Did I sound so well for Madrid? Okay, thank you so much, Madrid. Dave, man. All right. Madrid, Madrid 3. Man City 1. Madrid 3, Man City yes. 1 from Godwin. Thank you so much, yes. Godwin. Thank you. Happy now, rest. Yes. Hello, good Hello. evening. Hello, good evening, Kizika, Mr. Dozi. Welcome to the good show. Good evening to you, I greet you. Yeah, this is Medic calling from Ogu State. Okay, Medic, let's uh, have you. Welcome, Medic. Yeah, I'm very happy that uh, PS letter win the match yesterday. Okay, congratulations to I'm you. I'm very happy. <laughs> mm -hmm. And uh, today, all right. the England team are going home. Oh, all the England team are going home. Does yeah. it possible? <laughs> no, no, no we, we Medic, remain. we are sharing no it one one. No <laughs> one will remain. What did they do you? No one will remain. Asna, I know one Asna to reach semi final. That one day, side. What about but City? Man City, strong side. I wish them, I wish them to reach, but they, I, I have a, a good friend in that uh, club called Madrid. Oh, that Rodrigo. Rodri, so, Rodrigo goes. Okay. Let me, let me just, yeah. So let me just do it that way. So this year, all the glass team are going home. So predicting. Are you predicting yeah, today? Bayern and Asna. Right. I'm predicting Bayern and Asna. And I'm predicting with magic. So, <laughs> Bayern 3, Asna 1. Oh okay. All right, Bayern Alex. confirm 3, Asna 1. Uh, okay. Confirm 3. Magic. Safe, man. Okay. Safe, man. okay. Safe, man. He said he's predicting what magic. I don't know what the magic is got. Welcome to the show. What's your name? Good evening. My name is Tolu from Sydney. Did you say Tolu? Hello? Did you say your name is Tolu? My no? My name is Olulu from Olu. Olu. Okay, Olu, you're welcome. Great to have you on the show. Talk to me. Uh, I'm predicting from Madrid. Mm. I'm a man city. They are going to go to extra time. Two two. Ah. <laughs> After the extra time, Madrid is winning them. Uh -uh. How do you see this, Olu? Uh, hmm? eh? How are you seeing this? Uh, you know the two teams, they are very they are strong teams. Yeah. Uh, World class team. If you can see the first, if you can see the first leg, what happened in the first leg? Mm. So the first thing that's going to happen for the second leg now, and they're going to go for penalty. Okay, okay, I'll take for that from for you. For Asna, mm. for Asna, mm. Asna is going home. 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 Mm. Asna is going Asna goes home tonight. Okay, so I'm going with the prediction of two two. Have a wonderful day. You're going with the two two, right? The Madrid game. You're going with the two-two. That's the final prediction. The two-two, right? For the Madrid. Yeah, is that the one you're going to wait? That's the one you want to go with, right? Yes, yes. Okay, yes. safe, safe, yes. safe, man. Oh, <laughs> tonight is tonight. <laughs> it's like a final before final, does it? Mm -hmm. Like, like. <laughs> But well, the difference is just the home. They find out where they play before the main final. Okay. So, <laughs> Good evening. Welcome. Be. Good evening, this is Dotun. Dotun, you're welcome. What's your location, Dotun? Good evening. Dotun, are you calling from Ekotu? What? <laughs> oh, that's the rhymes, actually. From yeah, where? Welcome, bro. Did this is the first time caller? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh! Wow. Welcome. And I love to celebrate that, man! Great to have you on the show, Dotun. Talk to me. Yeah, I want to be big. All right, let's go, man. My area, my dude, we know that my capacity is like 3-2. Three mm. goes to two. But the other, uh, yeah. But the other noisy neighbor is now. I'll come in. <laughs> okay, I'll go with that. The only Chelsea that can win in the arena. All right. Oh, only Chelsea yeah. can win in the arena. I got that say, man. Dotto said Real Madrid too. Hala Madrid, when you see them, Charles is not around today. He had to go somewhere to get some, you know. 
all of the messages I'm seeing on WhatsApp, I'm going to definitely try to read them before I leave. Does it please a reminder just in case mm. I forget, though? Back to the phone lines. Welcome to the show. Good evening. What's your name? Is it first? Yes, I'm here. Welcome. Good evening. Is it? Yeah, it's Sati the boy calling from Nikaja. Sati the boy. Are you doing okay today? Yeah, I have to predict my match is Primati. Okay, Marty let's go. One zero. <laughs> okay, CT1. Harlem Madrid. One, yeah, 1-0. One zero, one zero. All right, I'll go with that, Sati the boy. Thank you so much for being part of the show. Mm -hmm. You can still drop it on WhatsApp if you feel like I can get on your call lines. Is that about the home? Good evening. Welcome to the show. What's your name? Yeah. Yeah. Good evening, sir. Good evening to you. Yeah, Kinsley from Ogusti. Okay, Kinsley. Welcome to the show. Yeah. I, I, I want to predict Arsenal game. Okay, Arsenal at the Alliance Arena yeah. tonight. But I'm Nick 4, Arsenal 1. <laughs> Those, did you hear that? And, uh, no, 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 no. Give me just one score line. <laughs> one score line would do. Okay. And now, Matthew will call him. Two England will call him. Okay, so what, what prediction do you want me to go down with I now? Nah, it's Arsenal. Bayern, I guess. Bayern for Arsenal yeah. 1. He don't like Arsenal, I guess. Are you a champion and you're the sound while he comes your way again. Tosi, don't forget after today, tomorrow we'll talk about Tosi football, right? Mm, of course. <laughs> some of the sizes of some club side. Let, let's complete what we started. Exactly. Hello, <laughs> welcome to the show. Good evening. What's your name? Hello, Kizike. Good evening. Good evening. What's your name? How are you? My name is Martin from Yanopaja. Martins from Yanopaja. Welcome yeah, to the show. Talk to me, Martins. Yeah, greetings to the Red Devil in the house. I Red meet you, Devils. I meet you, brother. Welcome, welcome, Martin. Martin. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he is indeed. Talk to me. Yeah, I wanted to predict that now game. Mm, okay, let's do it together. If you're ready, I'm cool. Yeah, I'm predicting that now three, Bayern Munich one. Bayern one, Arsenal three. Three, yeah, that's my prediction for okay. tonight. Okay, sounds like an Arsenal fan, Martin. Am I, am I right? Of course, I'm an, I'm an Arsenal fan. I mean, fan. it's clear. It's so clear. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. Thanks for staying here with me. <laughs> Thank you very much. Safe, man. A lot of messages on WhatsApp portal. Looks so lengthy, though. It is the time for you to be part of the show and predict. Your time is not really looking like my friend. Let's go back to the lines. Welcome. Good evening. What's your name? Hello. Good evening. Hi. Yeah, my name is Destiny. I'm calling from Jack and Day Gate. Did you say Destiny? Yes, Destiny, Destiny. Okay, Destiny from Jack and Day Gate. Talk to me, Destiny. Yes, uh, I give. I want to visit Arsenal Bayern. I All give right. Arsenal two one. Bayern. Bayern one, Arsenal two. Right. Yes. I'll go with that, Destiny. Thank you so much, Destiny. Save. Uh, thanks. All right, I don't mind. Also, you want to change your thought about who goes through tonight? <laughs> no, the two away games, away players are getting the win. The two away teams mm. will be getting the win. Hello, good evening. What's your name? It's your time. Let's talk. Good evening, TVT. Hi, good evening. What's your name? This is Delight from Russia. Okay, Delight, you're welcome. Talk to me. Um, I want to talk about that again. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> mm. um, I, th I think that Asma has shown that they can defend this season. Right. And, and this year, for, uh, they have only considered four or five goals in Premier League. Mm. 2024, I right. think they are, and, and Bayern are vulnerable at the back. They considered three against Manchester United. Mm. <laughs> so I say Manchester United, I guess it's functional Manchester United. Mm. So what of Arsenal? Mm. I'll okay. Give it to Arsenal. Okay, so tell me, what you make about Arsenal tonight? Two zero Arsenal. Arsenal two by my nickname. At Allianz Arena. This one, if it goes through, let's see how it goes. Thank you so much, uh, Delight. Okay, Have a nice day, all right. <laughs> A lot of messages on the portal. I'm still seeing them. Maybe by 5.53, I'm going to go back to the WhatsApp portal. Let's go on the phone line again. Hello, good evening. What's your name? Hello, good evening. This is JD from Leary. JD from Leary. Talk to me. Welcome. Yeah. It's a while. JD from Leary. Can, can yeah. you hear me? I know JD from Leary. I used to hear the name. You call on the show regularly. Right. Yeah. Yes. I'm predicting Arsenal. Um, Bayern Munich won Arsenal 2. Arsenal 2 go ahead. Uh -uh. Bayern Munich won. 
right? Arsenal 2. Okay, Bayern Munich 1, Arsenal 2. Okay, I'll go with that. Thank you so much, JD from Leary. Safe, man. All right. <laughs> Dozy, let me quickly run with you now. Talk about the scoreline for you. Please tell me. Just predict. I mean, you're not the octopus. We know this. Mm. Let's try. Well, if you ask me, my mm. City, Real Madrid, mm. I see a draw that will go into extra time for Madrid <laughs> to get. But the scoreline, mm. okay, so I should mention scoreline. Yeah. Take care. 2 2 draw. Because to me personally, Man City scoring just one, uh, not scoring a goal. Someone, I think someone gave them yeah. a clean sheet uh, yeah. to Real Madrid. Mm. I don't see them not scoring a goal against Real Madrid. They must score a goal. Real Madrid to must score a goal. And these two teams, they, they know how to give. Over 3.5 anytime both of them. <laughs> so okay. They go uh, above three goals most times. Okay. If if you check Hello, Hello, you yeah, I'm here. Welcome. Welcome. How are you? Hello. Good evening. Can you hear me? I'm I'm Ifani calling from uh Ilupeju. Ifani, you're welcome to the show. Great to have you join us. Uh please, I want to predict uh, Bayern Munich with uh against us now. Okay, let's go. Um I'm predicting three one. You I'm Bayern to win three one. Bayern three. Yeah, to so win three one. Yeah. Arsenal one. Thank you so much. All right, save. Oh, the score lines are really, 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 really not looking that so friendly. Oh, where do I go from here? The world news is coming up next for six p.m. right here. Chema Innocent in the building already. Though, welcome. Good evening. What's your name? Is that about? You're welcome. Talk to me quickly. How are you doing? Yeah, yeah, Mr. Pauline news from Isola. Okay, Pauline news from Isola. Called part late today. Talk to yeah. me. Yeah, so I want to predict that now. Okay. Arsenal 1-0. <laughs> Arsenal, Arsenal 1. one zero. Okay, that nail for uh -huh. Bayern, I presume. Thank you so much, uh, Pauline news. Right, yes. safe. Happy in address. Okay. Uh I'm just trying to place. I'm trying to end all the calls. We need to go now. I'm so sorry. I don't need to look at the phone lines again because uh, when I look, I'm getting confused. Let's go to the message on Water Portal quickly. Uh, Frederick from Ajangbadi says Madrid 2, Man City 1. Barton Day from Lagos Island says Manchester City 2, Real Madrid 4. Uh, this one says, Good evening, KZK. Congratulations to Paris and Germany. Although they got the win with the help of the red card given to Arojo, but the important thing is they won. So my prediction exactly. for the night goes like this. Real Madrid will win with the tie 3, Madrid 3, Man City 2. Richard from Oshodi. And also on this one saying good evening. Look at that's Paulie News. He just called. He said Arsenal to Bayern Munich. No, is it changing his thoughts? I'm quite confused here. Paulie News, uh, which will I go with? Uh, don't confuse me now, please. Uh, this one says good evening, KZK. In relation to Paris and German, although they got... Uh, okay, I got this. Um, KZK, this is Terry from 7. Now, nope, okay. Bayern Munich 3, Arsenal 1. Uh, Ezekiel from Egypt will say uh, Bayern 2, Arsenal 3 A lot of messages, I can't read all of these But I will just make sure I stay back here together On them before uh, I leave the studio uh, But Dozy, how do you feel on the show today? Yeah, uh, that, that was a good one But all, uh, all I have to say is mm. I wanted to say something about Marcel Sabisa, you know. Oh, you see, you're yes, still the champion. I, 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 right? It still pains me that this um, United <laughs> had to let that. You know like, you. If you come to you that, they talk concern you. <laughs> yeah, you know, there's what we call football intelligence, right, being right, able right. to read the game. That mm -hmm. guy has it. Yeah. And if you come to that club, sorry to to deviate a little. If right. you come to my United, you won't get a play apart from Bruno that uses. And then the younger uh, minor mm. people that can read the game ahead right. of before it it is even played, they will say, okay, this is the way I have to put the ball. Mm -hmm. He, that guy has his intelligence well. and he, he has that football intelligence right. and he has the power to do it but unfortunately it happened the way it happened mm. just go out and, and you know this night go and enjoy yourself rep your club but remember you know football without violence does he i mean that's what he says all the time he want to leave the mic he said to preach football without violence there's no space for that now you know right but i remain the voice of the mic without god there is never key zk Apologies that the phone line is beeping, but I'm just pretending like I'm not saying it though. Probably knows if I knew all of the names on WhatsApp portal, YouTube as well. Zubitez, Goldwyn, Maddox, Olu, Dotun, Sati, The Boy, Kingsley, Martin, Destiny, Delight, JD from Leary. Amazing people on the outside. Without you, trust me, this show wouldn't be a fly. And that's how much I love you, trust me. There is nothing wrong in starting small. But is everything wrong when you settle for less? Keep dreaming, big legal city. Work hard to make it a reality. 
Go out and enjoy great football tonight. It is a night of Champions League. And if I had my way, I would have asked Anna Siki, just going into the studio, what you make tonight. Well, this man always tell you that it's a walkover. My name is KZK. I'm out. <laughs> 